This is super easy. All I'm doing is taking a piece of maple and I'm gonna lay out where I want my gauges. Two and a half inches in from the edge to the center of the hole and then about three inches down from the top and the bottom and then the one in the middle that just centered up. I took it over to the miter saw and I cut it at about 13 and a quarter inches long. And then over to the crosscut sled where I cut it five inches wide. I just use a chamfer bit here to go around the edge just to give it a little definition. I had to use a hole saw at about two and a half inches, but if you have a Forstner bit that's slightly under two and a half, it works much better. Then from there, we just sand it to 120 grit. And then a mineral oil bath to make it pop. Man, that thing, pretty. This is a friction fit ring, and because our holes were slightly oversized, I'm gonna glue these in with CA glue. If you purchase the right size bit, you won't have to worry about doing this. Once the glue is dry, you can arrange those in any orientation you want. I prefer the temperature to be on top, humidity in the middle, and barometer on bottom. 